Hello from Coleman and Company. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to navigate our site to order new hoops for your embroidery machine. Now, if you've gotten to this video and you weren't on our website when you found it, you're going to want to join us at Coleman, C O L M A N and company all spelled out dot com once you're there you'll be on our home page like this there might be a new ad up or something like that but either way our menu should be about the same once you've come to the main page you can either put your cursor over the word embroidery where you can then just uh, go ahead and select jerky hoops or you can click on the word embroidery and it'll take you to our embroidery supply page and then you can either select jerky hoops here or here. Either way, you'll end up in the same place. So here is our Jerky Hoops page. Now, um, here on the Jerky Hoops page, there you can see we carry quite a selection of hoops, okay? Uh, when it comes to what type of machine you have, that's the second step, but remember that there are two measurements involving your hoop, okay? I'm about to show you how. So click here on the view instructions so you can kind of follow along with me on what measurements it'll be asking you for. The first measurement being shown is not actually the sewing area. The first thing we need to determine is your first measurement, which is from end to end, from ear to ear, from the end of this metallic part to the end of this metallic part. That is your first measurement, okay? Um, depending on what type of machine you have, this might vary. Gosh, you might have even moved your arms and have a different measurement than what some of your hoops are. I suggest choosing whatever you most often sew with, that hoop, and go with that measurement, okay? So you're going to measure from ear to ear. I'm going to do that with you here in a second. And then the second measurement is going to be the internal sewing area, whether you have a 12 by 12 square or, um, you know, a 15 centimeter round. That can vary, but first measurement is ear to ear. So let's do that now. Okay. Now, after we've determined our measurement from ear to ear, now let's go ahead and select the type of machine we have. So um, I have an Avance, so I'll go ahead and select Avance. And you can see, okay, here are the options I have. I know I use this for jacket backs, but the majority of my hoops are right here, the 14 and a quarter, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and select this, the 360 14 and a quarter, because that's the one it is. So. Um, Aha, uh -huh, this is the one. I'm going to go ahead and click. You'll see 360, 14 and a quarter. That's the one. Now, here within this selection, I have confidence in knowing that from ear to ear, it's going to fit in my machine. Now I choose the actual sewing area that I'm going to want to work with. This is the part where, you know, if you're looking for something specific, like a sleeve, I'd choose this one, uh, and vice versa. So it's quite that simple. Once you've selected whichever hoop you're going to purchase, we'll pretend this is what I'm going with, you're going to go ahead and proceed on to checkout. Now, please keep in mind, when you order a jerky hoop, it is not going to be coming from Coleman and Company. You are going to receive it directly from Jerky. So they're going to be drop shipping it to you. You'll go ahead and check out like normal, and then yours will be ordered right away. Uh, of course, if you have any questions, don't hesitate to give us a call at Coleman and Company, 1 800 891 1094. We appreciate your time and happy sewing.